Welcome back. As always, be sure to comment if you have any comments about the channel in general, and let's just get right into it. So we last left off. Hello. Smooth operator. Glad you're here. Cause I oh yeah, this guy. I used to run with a smuggling crew called the Rogues. Well, I called them in to find the key fragment, and they did. Infiltrated the COV and went deep undercover. So deep that now I can't get a hold of those bastards. So I need you to track them down. Here, take this. We call that a rogue site. Oh, uh, this is a weird one with like the shooting explode. different targets. Fingers isn't crossed. That? It's me birthday. Rogue site can do it all, baby. <laughs> Leave secret messages, hide loot, mark POIs, lay traps. Every smuggler in the rogues uses one. And now you got one. Like I said, the rogue. Do I make it equip it? There it is. COV while looking for the fragment. With that rogue site, you can track them down. I hit some loot nearby. Go on, give the rogue site a whirl. Just look through the scope. <laughs> Neat. Uh, what did I last left off? Oh yeah, we just uh, went to the family jewel ship. Freed Balex. He's he's joining the team now. And now we're still looking for the uh, vault fragment. I'll try in the front, jeez, I'm stupid. Oh, and I did, uh, respec my tree, uh, in between episodes, videos, episodes? Yeah, video sounds better. Uh, so now everything is in the, uh, drone. Jesus, I I am all scatterbrained. I don't know what is happening. And if I go just get all these things. I know it's extra, but yeah, not a bad gun either. So yeah, now everything is about kill skills. Uh, moving fast, and the drone is just a lot better. So that's that's a lot better. Cause yeah, this uh, this laser's pretty cool, but uh, yeah, it's not that great, and it really definitely lost its appeal. I thought it'd get like cool abilities, like uh. You shoot it and make like a mini black hole that sucks enemies in and like explodes, like you know, it can be like Maya's thing. Where's the fucking road mark? This thing? Okay. I was about to say, if I don't find it in like five seconds, I'm not gonna look because I wasn't even worth my fucking time anyway. Jesus. Breakthrough. Jesus Christ, I have 600 iridium. Is iridium even useful in this game? I'm glad they made cash useful because now that's used for storage deck upgrades. What is iridium used for? Anything? And I don't even know why I got in there. Is iridium actually used for anything good? Well, he's throwing some work. Yeah, see, now it's got like lasers and rockets and shit. Yeah, now I really don't have to do anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Crew built a secret entrance in. Use the 
rogue site to find it. Keep shooting those marks, Vault Hunter. Wait. Is there another one? Oh my god. What the hell is that? This is this is dumb. It's kind of a cool gimmick, but like it zooms in so far. Oh my god, it's way over here. Why would it not be on the fucking door? Oh my god, that's just stupid. At least it does decent damage. Some Jacobs whose name I don't remember. Line the swamp. None comes to the top of my head, but I really feel like I've had missions like this where it's like, alright, use our forced gun with a ghoul gimmick to it. And then it's just terrible, so you can't even really use it. Probably should have listened to what he was saying. Oh well. Yeah, like you can drop grenades and shit. Now I actually have to pay attention to what my grenade mod is. I think I just have some legendary one equipped, but uh, now that kind of matters. A good old Donnie Brook, eh? <laughs> yes, even though I have nothing in that skill tree anymore. I'm still doing solid enough damage. And like the couple of special effects I could give it didn't do much, but the drone actually has like a lot of differences. I guess this game's more focused on uh... Uh... What do you call it? You more just help, uh... The kid. What the hell did he get help from? Oh fuck, I thought I saw one off in my... Yes, I did. Hey there, Goliath. Yeah, it's kind of a shame that, uh... This game having like each Vault Hunter has three different abilities or three different variations and stuff. Really cool idea. I like that. But then I guess it would be a lot harder to make skill trees. Like that they did it right of like, oh, now you just have little extra things on the side. It's not like you don't have to spend skill points in it. You just have to get that far in the tree and then you can add these modifiers. The problem with only being able to have two is you can't really uh, change them wildly. Like in Borderlands 2, like some of the some of the abilities, like I should say, got pretty wild. Like I know if you went in the right skill trees with uh, the psycho, especially, holy shit, and you turn into a badass psycho and do more flame shit, you can like. Shoot fire, I guess that'd be marked to him. Yep, you guessed it. You can use the rogue site to find. But you can actually get his uh Ferocity is my middle name. Then Ferocity Flint. Oh my god, that's right. What? Is it not here? Do I have to go up? 
Is that not a door? Am I crazy? I think I might be crazy. How do I have to go? Am I, am I crazy or is it this game that, uh, yeah, shoot rogue sight mark. Okay, so there's one here. But, uh, am I crazy or was that not there before? I'm thinking they're just not spawning in for me now. Like, what the hell? That was not for level up, huh? All of the, you can increase effect and duration. Eh. See, and like, that's a pretty lame cap skill. Like, this whole build is all about kill skills, which is really cool. I like that. But then just having the cap skill of, yeah, they're all just better. That seems pretty lame. Forget his name, but guess it don't matter now. Ain't gonna put the candy back in that pinata. Are you sad or are you not? Like, you can't have it both ways. Me and that fella used to be the pride of the Vastlands. Now he's just cold cuts and guts. Yeah, see, so you're not sad that these people are dead. Hard to make out the face, but that's Archimedes' ID. Guess he's really gone. Grab a security ID, Vault Hunter. We might need it. All right, we should check the security console. Let's take a look. Uh, when's Archimedes coming back? Said to hunker down. Extraction ain't happening today. Maybe tomorrow. How long does he think we can keep this fragment hidden? Swamp's crawling with COV. Hey, what the hell? How'd they find us? <laughs> Someone got the drop on my rogues and took the fragment. But I ain't no detective. Good thing I've got something pretty damn close. Hit that button over there. See, from time to time, a smuggler needs to drop his cargo in a hurry. So, the rogues use a special loot tracker, designed it myself. With that baby, we can hunt down lost cargo across the entire planet. But in this case, we're gonna track down that fragment and the traitor who stole it. Damn, forgot about that. See, every rogue has a security ID, like the one you picked up from that bloody mess that was my man Archimedes. Looks like whoever killed my rogues was smart enough to take the rest of their IDs. Good thing I still got a few live agents in the field. You'll need to get their IDs before we can activate the loot tracker. Let's start with I HP. can't use He's the, the one I just picked up. Make contact with D while I alert the others on a secure line and tell them you're coming. Gah! Agent D is a master of disguise <sighs> and traps and a hell of a pole dancer. <laughs> Which is more useful in this galaxy than you might think. You'll see. Agent D's been running a honeypot. He's got them COV hypnotized. Until you signal the cover, again, those I? bandits won't lift a finger. Figures. Those dumb bandits fell for Tyrene because no one else here loved them or looked at them. But that ain't a reason to burn down the galaxy. Okay, where do I have to go? Oh, God. How about just the layout of these environments, or do I expect you to go, but just nothing ever seems to be lined up right. I just keep finding myself getting lost. Take that, you ganky nub! Yeah, ganky nub, eh? Let me stab him. I don't know why I'm here. I have no fight with you people. Let's the speed run. Ooh. Ooh, 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 what 
the hell? What the hell was that? Good job, drone. Gotta change out the shotgun, though. And the assault rifle, honestly. I have heard that line so many times. Like, once in a while, he's actually got some lines that make me, like, giggle. heard you. I don't know who the hell you were. Hmm. Shit. Hmm. Yeah, see like that one right there. Your parents should be ashamed of you. That's a good one. I bet I didn't get that. Oh, no, because I'll definitely get sick of that line, too. But, uh, that's still a better line than, I'm on fire! Not literally, though. Jesus Christ, to hear that so much. Clay says there's a traitor among us, and you need my ID. All yours, babe. Whoever the traitor Thank is, you. Clay is going to tear him limb from limb if I don't find him first. Okay. Now it's time to track down quiet Oh shit. That that's a good one. I've never had that happen before. Holy shit, I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> I not know that was a thing that could happen. That's awesome. Hopefully it actually does some damage. Cause yeah, I don't know if I'm just using that legendary wrong or what, but it was just not doing much. Oh my god. Hey, hope you're hearing this. I think one of the rogues turned COV. I'm going undercover to investigate. Find me and we'll share intel. That's kind of a good joke. Guess I'll give it a whack. Now I realized I was like completely silent, but instead I was like, yeah. <laughs> Die. Jesus. Someone definitely sold out the rogues, Clay. See, I infiltrated an offshoot of the Reekwater gang called the Mudnicks. Turns out Aurelia Hammerlock offered one of the rogues the Eden 7 system in exchange for a key fragment. Expect you to die, Bolt Hunter? No. Then assume the worst. I'm either dead or captured. But come find me anyway. I'd do it for you. Quietfoot's a crazy bastard. <laughs> we go way back. You gotta find him, Vault Hunter. Did they sell out? I expect you to die, Vault Hunter. I'm not gonna do it. But. Is that basically the same side mission from Warlands 2 where Handsome Jack tells, is, says he'll pay you to kill yourself? Because, I mean, that was a hilarious mission of, like, 
you know, because you get revived anyway, and he just laughs at you. He's like, kill to it! Oh my god, you're so stupid. It was awesome! It's like, yeah, see, that? that's a very handsome Jack moment. Did... Are they doing the same thing here? Because... Uh, I guess I can't, I can't get mad at it. Because that might not be the mission. But even like a twist on that feels like they're just trying to copy from Borderlands 2. And I really can't imagine that they would can do it better or even in like a I have zero faith that they can do it in a any kind of justice way. Because that was such a fun this. Ah, I see. Because that was just a very fun little side mission. Yeah. I'm getting upset about something I'm not even, I don't even know about. Because I believe it. I believe that they would do that. They would just completely steal a side mission from Borderlands 2 because they can't think of a good one for themselves. Ah, I see. <laughs> Alright, that one got me. Ah! Where's the tram? Quick! Fucking close up. Alright, that was a good one. That one got me, game. I'll give that one to you. See, that's the thing, like, comedy in games is really hard to do. And I remember absolutely hating the comedy of this game, and for the most part, I know why I overall remember hating it. But there are some good moments like that in there, and there's more. It wasn't just that moment, like, I've laughed at quite a few random things, just catch me off guard. I, am I really think it all comes right back to how hard it seems like they were trying to make the Calypsos, like, funny. Like, they were trying really hard to make the Calypsos funny. And it just does not work. And I think that's... Jesus. That's a big reason why... I remember this game being not that funny. Best sharpshooting anywhere. That's got to be Mordecai, right? It's not, because we've already met Mordecai. We know about him, but uh, who the hell is this guy? What the hell did you say? That's all I'm gonna do. I don't really want to fight them. Reveal your secrets. I see you coming, Vault Hunter. Like I said, he was working with some serious muscle. I'm in a secure location overlooking a dock full of COV. Need some help clearing them out. We'll talk after. Thanks. COV, these are monkeys. How the bloody hell do you reload this thing? <laughs> No. No. Bad monkey. Oh my god, how many are there? 
Jesus, should I not fight these guys either? Shotgun's definitely an improvement though. No, my god, I didn't even go the right way. Cool. Uh, yeah, it's close enough to the right way. That's definitely something I gotta check uh, when playing through, like, the pre-sequel in Borderlands 2 is I don't remember getting lost this much or the area is just much more straightforward I guess because I'm pretty sure they were but there was the waypoint way more like on a trail because I feel like this is just all right waypoint at the objective and I either go the wrong way or take wrong turns I'm, I'm thinking it's map design that's what I'm gonna chop it down to is that there's so many like up and down and caves and uh, cliffs more, I guess not so much caves, but a lot of cliffs. Where it's like, alright, you gotta go this way, but oh wait, you gotta like drive way around. Like you can't just look at the mini-map and run that direction, you gotta go in weird directions. So it's like the Warlands 2 map just more straightforward, or... I why do I feel like they were so much easier to uh, navigate? Like, I just don't remember getting lost, ever. But here, I'm, I feel like I'm constantly checking the map every time a new objective comes up. Oh shit. Oh god. Oh my god, what the hell was that? Kidding me? What? Okay, that one. Yeah, that one missed. How did that even miss? Did that fucking go like that right next to me? But a uh, random bandit killed him. Oh my god, that's embarrassing. See? Shit like that. That made me laugh. That was a good one. That was a good intro. Look both ways before crossing enemy line of fire. That's good. That's good shit. Also feels like they've really cranked up the uh, critical effectiveness. I got a game like, yeah, oh, yeah, you do some damage critical. This is like, you hit any body shot. Yeah, you just winged them. You hit a critical. Oh yeah, fucking insta kill every time. No matter what you use it or what. Or whatever. You hit the head. Insta kill. Oh, do I have an hyper score for this mission? Really didn't feel like it earlier. The hell is this on for? Oh, goody. Nope, I don't even have that. What the hell? Why do I have a little symbol like, hey, you gotta check your, uh... Oh fuck. Yeah, why are they back called suicide bombers again? Martyrs. Mr. Reeves. 
dropships come in day in and day out. See, those cultists are running an organ trafficking ring. Slicing up poor SOBs and selling their parts all across the galaxy. So, I set up a ship scanner so I can track the shipments. When you know it, Jesus. that ship scanner's broken. You're gonna have to climb that crane to fix Jesus. the darn thing and get it into position. Then I can track the ship. Appreciate it. <laughs> oh, it is this crane way to climb. Did they say Latroy? You can almost taste it. Oh my god. I was like completely zoned out. For quite a while. I kind of forgot I was even playing though. So holy shit. I did. Maybe uh... Maybe this won't be uploaded today. I might have to take a nap or something. Jesus. No clay, say it ain't so. Loyalty's all we got. Gotta get rid of all these things. Even though I died once, it is kind of crazy how easy this is because I really shouldn't have died. That was kind of bullshit. But, uh, yeah, I literally had just that one video of me doing bonus missions because I was like four levels behind. I'm like, yeah, I should get a little closer. And yeah, and I've been two levels behind in the past how often now and still really nothing nothing bad to really happening like this is going all right purple the hell This lady had a hat in her pants. I'm not alone. Lord. Clean Larry catching up. Yeah, alright. Your butler said you wanted to talk. Let's just uh, see if I'm on the right track to where I gotta go first. Kinda. Uh, that's my boyfriend, and his name is Alistair. He don't talk like us, does he? No, he don't. All right, 
So what gives, Wainwright? Ooh. Been a long time since you asked me for a drink. Reckon this stuff wasn't even in a barrel back then. I wanted to talk about Jacobs. Your daddy's fine. Monty's spooked, that's all. Galaxy's burning down and he wants to know how far it'll spread. But none of the other corporations know what to do. Join forces or grab a torch and hope the winds don't change. But Eden will be fine. If there ain't no vault, the children won't come to play. Yeah. Yeah, see, that's what I want to discuss. Tom's come to let you in on a family secret. Well, I gotta be family for that, don't I? Don't get ahead of yourself, Slick. Hmm. That was nice. That was just a nice, sweet little bit of, uh, world building. Didn't really amount to much, just that, I guess. Papa Jacobs was worried about the COV. And I guess the whole company would have been, like, kind of freaking out about it. I thought it was a pirate. I feel like that joke would have been better if it wasn't the who are you again part. Yeah, that's the kind of humor is like, eh. I mean, everyone's a critic, obviously, but eh. <laughs> Not the best joke. Well, like I said, everyone's a critic. <sighs> Hell, I have a shit ton of terrible jokes on my other channel, but that's what's built off of other uh, terrible jokes. I haven't even, like, mentioned my other channel since I started making videos in this one again, have I? That, like, used to be part of my outro, or intro. I think it was outro. But so yeah, go check out YC Games if you like, well, gaming videos, more comedy, funny, me and my friends just goofing off. This is the most sophisticated tracker of money can buy. Beats drones, bots, you name it. In every we'll also post on that video too. And the rep channel. Further, you know, that fancy word for waiting. Here it is. The loot tracker. Hello, Jabber. I use one of these for an ancient job. Look to known smuggler secret. You want to find something? Use a jabber. Fast as hell. Got a nose like a bloodhound. We digitized that little bastard so it doesn't crap everywhere. I ain't no turd farmer. Now follow that jabber. Ado! Ah, that's the word. Without further ado, learn that from a guy I killed. Real egghead. Hold the book and everything. You know. Despite being betrayed by one of my See, own that was another one of those. <laughs> hey, you got me. That was stupid. But you got me. That's a fancy word to learn from that man. See, that's the crazy part. Like, I like a lot of this game. Like, the gameplay. Awesome. Guns are pretty cool. Wish the legendaries were a little more legendary feeling, but overall, I like it. Uh, where's I going with this? Oh yeah, the story has a shit ton of good ideas, and there's lots of good jokes kind of sprinkled throughout there. But a lot of good ideas go nowhere, and all those sprinkled in good jokes are surrounded by not that great of jokes. I get though, humor subjective. Which is pretty nuts that you'd even ever attempt to make a uh, video game with humor. 
because a lot of people are turned off from Borderlands because they think the jokes are atrocious. I like a lot of the whole, like, awkward lo style of comedy, as long as it doesn't go too far. That's why I feel like a lot of Borderlands 3 went too far. They're like, oh, we, we, we get what we are. It's like, eh. Referencing you know what you are. It's, it, it's weird. I don't even know where I'm going with this, but... A lot of good things in this game, a lot of bad things. The humor definitely being somewhere in the middle there. Two purples? Two wars? Wow! Now it's, it's under my understanding that we're in the middle of a war. Two wars? Wow! That Jabber's trying to tell us something. Oh, I hear. Cool. Jabber's saying the fragment's just up there. Nice job, little Jabber. Do your thing, baby. Where's it right, going? Well, Let's get that fragment and find what? out who betrayed Wouldn't it the like just disappear? Why why is it crawling away? Alright, whatever. Bye. Bye Jabber. Go do your thing again, I guess. Going through all those, I was waiting for them. High enough level to get some of this shit. Okay. Cool idea, especially like this dude that like grows and shrinks, and he shrinks like super, super tiny, he can get pretty big. Okay, now I can pull that Ant Man shit. Still, though. Cool idea. Got the fragment, boyo. Hey, that's great, man. Vault Hunter, I'm oh. told you have recovered another I'm supposed to go to sanctuary. Please come see me on sanctuary. Damn, I really I am completely misremembering this area. I really thought we just killed Aurelia and then killed the vault. Like that was it. I completely forgot that there was like all these side missions or not side missions, or main missions, but you know what I mean? All these missions about going and uh, getting the vault key fragments and all that jazz. Why did I start this conflict? I can just teleport to a uh, sanctuary. I don't need this fight. 
I guess one thing is I'm done with this gun. I guess I'll right now, or I have to wait until, uh... Wow, even mid-fight you can just teleport out. That's crazy. That's ridiculous. That's, anytime bots die, I'm like, mm, I don't want to lose the, like, 600 bucks or whatever fucking insignificant bullshit is. Okay, so if the last Valky is where Rula is. So we're probably gonna a new ship AI have to kill it. Lisps denote supreme intelligence, you know. One time my okay. two weeks after I stole a monk's glass eye. Why are you here? Shut the fuck up. Give. That leaves only one more. Fragment. Once you acquire it, I will join you at the vault. Tannis, I don't like this. Lilith, I understand your concern, but the facts remain. The Calypsos will come to feed on the vault monster. My presence is required to ensure that when they arrive, their dinner plate will be empty. Trust me, Lilith, it has to be me. It's her choice to go down, Lilith. And we have to do something, or the Calypsos get exactly what they want. I fucking hate you, Ava. Ava, human emotions are well outside of my expertise, but I must state the obvious. Troy Calypso killed Maya, not Lilith. There is enough fighting going on out there. This may not have been the family you signed up for, but it is the one you have. Tannis, I... She'll figure it out. What's the plan then, Lilith? Wainwright knows where the final key fragment is. We go for the vault. This time, if the Calypsos come, we'll be ready for them. Wainwright seemed pretty revved up. I can't blame him. Who wouldn't jump at the chance to take back what was stolen from them? Good luck, Vault Hunter. Don't worry, I got this ship on lockdown, baby. Oh my god. What happens if we talk to Ava this time? So, since you're already doing stuff. Okay, no, I thought I thought it was the same. Like she was upset, and she would have a voice line of what just happened. Cause the hell is in here? Is this garbage shoot? Like do anything with it? Why is this door open? That door should have stayed locked. What the hell? Anyway, fucking Eva. God damn it! I hate her so much. She is such a just a bad, annoying character. Th thank God Tannis is there and fucking actually being the voice of reason. So I guess setting her on the right path. So presumably that's probably the start of her redemption arc, I guess, of like, hey, you know, don't be a bitch to Lilith. Like, that's basically what Tannis says. Like, hey, you're being a dick right now. You know that, right? Fuck, I guess we'll see. I don't. I remember just hating her all the way through. I guess let's hope that that's the start of some kind of redemption arc. And maybe she'll earn Maya's powers by the end of it. I doubt it. I don't remember what happens, but I remember hating her, so I really doubt that they do anything good. But we're getting it there. Let's take a gander real quick. Level 29. Ooh, 26? I can't fucking read what level I am. Nope, still can't. Twenty twenty six, so we're three behind. And I believe this is the one where we're gonna fight a vault monster. So I'm gonna probably the next uh, episode's gonna video is gonna be like a level up mission, do a couple side missions, get to probably level twenty eight at least, so we'll stay just one level behind. Uh, so yeah. Look forward to that. 
I guess if there's are any side missions in particular that you remember really liking and wanting me to do, let me know down in the comments and I'll be sure to do them. I'm probably going to go back and do that uh, suicide mission just to see if they did just rip off the Borderlands 2 mission because I will be upset. Uh, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. As always, you leave a comment if you have any comments about the channel in general. Any notes about how I should improve these videos? Uh, who I should be for pre-sequel? Definitely leaning more towards being uh, Jack, the doppelganger. Uh, and yeah, and if I should do Tales from the Borderlands next or pre-sequel, let me know all that stuff down in the comments. And as always, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.